Well, we have observed uh, several affectations to our territory. For example, the increasing of temperature in uh, regions where usually had uh, lower temperatures and in some cases increases of uh, about four degrees to the historic normal temperatures. Um, we also have been uh, affected by some climate events uh, which are stationary, which uh, we, uh, in let's say in the past decades, we didn't have this kind of, of effects. Our president, Carlos Alvarado, is very committed to the environment, to the environment and he um, has uh, set to our country a very ambitious goal on decarbonization. But we, we think that the magnitude of the problem uh, really deserves that we are ambitious. As a country, we, uh, the energy we produce is about 98% coming from renewable, renewable resources. But the problem is that when it comes to uh, transportation, there we have uh, strong emissions, uh, carbon emissions that we'd want to decrease. And that's why uh, decarbonization for us is uh, very important as a country. We need to generate new knowledge, but we also have to find very different solutions. Every little action we take as citizens has a huge impact in the environment because of the amount of people we are now. So we have to, to deal with the problems that we caused, but we also have to make sure that we don't create new problems. That means we have to, by means of innovation, find uh, ways to be more effective in terms of production, in terms of consumption, and also to think about the new products and services that will help us face our current challenges, but without taking from nature what uh, is not necessary to take from it. I think this uh, these kind of initiatives are uh, very important uh, in order, to, on the one hand, to raise awareness of the consequence of, consequence of our way of living, and uh, also to uh, provide these opportunities for networking, because we need all the knowledge and all the talent available worldwide in order to face uh, these challenges and you know, be successful in in uh, providing the new solutions. So understanding the best practices from uh, each country, the new ideas, and see how our knowledge and initiatives can complement each other, learning from each other, and uh, finding ways of mutual collaboration are definitely the key to solve the, the problems we have now. Well, I wish a future of peace, of peace with nature, of peace with, uh, between nations, but also with nature. Because uh, we're on a planet that is being shared not only by humans, but also from, with many other uh, forms of life that also deserve a planet to live in. I think as humans, we have a responsibility for all the other species and for the damage we have caused to them.